The last cornerstone of the newly fashioned Mercedes-Benz car program, under the direction of Ferdinand Porsche, was the type Nürburgring 460. The name recalled a test drive on the Nürburgring, where a Type 460 was driven 20,000 kilometers in 13 days. This was the first mass-produced Mercedes with an eight-cylinder engine and premiered at the Paris Auto Show in October 1928. Fifteen thousand Reichmarks was the handsome price of a Pullman limousine of the Nürburgring type, which was already being revised in its second year. The previous high-frame chassis was replaced by a low-frame, which gave the vehicle a more elegant appearance. Moreover, a variation with a shortened wheelbase was produced and designated with a K. This shorter chassis could accommodate a four to five seat passenger compartment. The regular Nürburgring 460 with a standard wheelbase was available as an open top touring car or Pullman limousine, each sitting six to seven. From 1931 on, the Nürburgring 460 was optionally supplied with overdrive or economy drive for an extra 2,000 Reichmarks. The add-on charge also included Zeiss headlights. Together with its 5-liter engine, this marked the birth of the later type, Nürburgring 500. Visually, this model with its greater cubic capacity could not be differentiated from Model 460, the production of which was finally stopped in 1933. The successor was renamed Type 500, or 500N, and is recognizable by its slightly slanted windshield and V-shaped radiator. After a delivery total of 931 vehicles, the last seven units of the Type 500 were produced in October 1939.